Wow, check this place out. It's like a palace. Talk about class. Let me just drink it all in. Help, young man. You must help me. Please. I'm afraid there's nothing. about me being deceased. You don't have to worry. It is indeed too late for that now. Then what's the matter? You see, I am a tour guide. The last living, oh, I mean, non-robotic. Oh, this is really difficult. I get it. So? I did such a solemn concluding tour before handing over all functions to these Tereshkovas. And I had a group of students. They underwent polymer treatment and were awarded a visit to the facility. Talk about bad timing. Exceptionally bad timing. You see, I am worried about them. They must be somewhere here in the exhibition halls. They may already be. Listen, I understand that you should be evacuating, but you can obviously take care of yourself. You are a security guard, aren't you? Something like that. Find them, please. They scattered when everything started. I can't leave them like this. I answer for their well-being with my life. I did it again, didn't I? All right, calm down. I'll try to find them. Thank you. Thank you so much. Tell me when you find everybody, will you? There were two lads and two young women. I will be here. It's not like I can go anywhere now. See that coming. Well, did everything go according to plan? Quite. What? You said we wouldn't be together. So I wanted to die. You're not wrong. When you're falling off a bridge, it feels like you can fix anything. Except for the fact you're falling off a bridge. But as I was lying here, I suddenly realized there is no idea stupider than giving up on life because of a boyfriend. It even sounds ridiculous. Yeah. Sorry to hear that. I'll tell the guide I found you. She was... worried. Okay. 
Okay, this is new. What's wrong with her head? Welcome. Come closer. Be not afraid of my power. What the f- Charles, is this another corpse? I am Oracle. I am the all seen I used to be a simple archive worker. But now I am omnipotent. I see everything. I know every. Okay, this is new. What's wrong with her head? What the? Ch- I am What is this skepticism? Sergei Alexeyevich, you should be catching Viktor Petrov instead of doubting my greatness. An interesting deviation. This woman is suffering from polymer overdose. This can happen when a human brain is connected to a large body of data. Obviously, this is what killed her. And now, for a brief time, the Oracle has merged with the entire VDNH. She can access all computers, cameras, and terminals. So she's part of the complex? With unrestricted access to everything? What? Huh. So, you're the Oracle, huh? Can you prove it? I have no need to prove my power to you, mortal. But I guess I could indulge you for amusement's sake. What do you want? Shall I tell you about your missing past? Or the kind spirits that look after you and will silently weep forever? But what would be the point? If you can't even see what's going on right under your nose. (sighs) That's quite a load of... something. Let's make this simple. Open this door for me, would ya? Will I? I will. (laughs) I can open all doors, both in the past and the future. Behold, open up! Uh, 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 uh. Oof, too much information can drive you crazy. Indeed. I'd like to compliment you on your resourcefulness. That was clever. I guess you can think outside the box. Yeah, yeah, I'm real proud of myself. She sure was a useful lady. How'd she find out about me and my mission at Vavilov if she never left the VDNH? That is a trenchant observation, Comrade Major. And a very good question. One that I have no answer for. Charles, what do the special neuroconnectors from Sechenov's team look like? The special neuroconnectors have the Greek letter Gamma on them and are shaped like bracelets. They are worn on the right arm. Gamma? What happened to Beta? Or are those the fake connectors you told me about? The fake connectors do in fact have the letter beta on them, but the beta connectors were real at first. Uh, I don't get it. The first experimental prototypes of the neuroconnectors with discretionary authority were called beta connectors. There were only two of them, and Dr. Sechenov designed them to look like rings. So, what happened to them? After the necessary experiments were complete, Dr. Sechenov removed these rings from the list of special neuroconnectors. Enhanced gamma models, shaped like bracelets, were then made for the scientists, one for each member of his team. Okay, there are only seven of those gamma connectors? For Vavilov, Korolyov, Kurchatov, Lebedev, Pavlov, Filimonenko, and Chelome? Indeed.
Congratulations. Except it doesn't matter anymore. What do you mean it doesn't matter? Do you even know who he is? He'll build you a country house, mm -hmm. huh? Send you on a vacation, or maybe you want a car? Come on, man, just get me out of here! Whoever your old man is, his son is dead. What? What do you fucking mean, dead? How am I talking to you, then? Are you an idiot? You are the working class. So work, damn you! Do you even know who I am? No, I don't, and I don't care. We're not buddies. Get that through your thick skull, and the working class can punch back, you spineless piece of... Meat? What? Uh, am I really? Shit. And yes, you are. I'll pass it along to your tour guide. Yeah, but not all of them. I'll let you know if I find the rest. Cycle. Module, limb, leg, left. Not found. <sighs> Just great. So where am I even supposed to look? I swear on my cooling unit, these mustached perverts must have dragged her into the maintenance room. I'm on my way. This place used to be really nice, until everybody got killed. It is a most tragic sight.
Hey, this is new. You may need to apply spatial reasoning here. There's no may about it. These locks of yours are really something, you know that? Saving data. Mm, you look so focused, honey. Are you thinking about me? Buzz off, I'm working on my equipment. I hope you're not thinking about that nasty doctor slut. Who? What are you even talking about? Why, Petrov's vulgar and graceless whore, of course. <laughs> you mean Dr. Falatova? I do not care what her name is. She better keep away from you if she knows what's good for her. Falatova will stand trial and be punished for aiding and abetting traitors to the motherland. I knew she was a criminal, sugar. Let's string her up. Oh, it will be fun. I promise. Shut up. You electric sheep. What did you just say, handsome? I said fuck off. You heard me just fine. Oh, I love it when you are angry. Punish me. Man, you are so fucked up. Hey, Charlie, why couldn't they just put regular, more reliable locks everywhere? Like with codes and shit? I suspect it's because if they had, anyone who hacked the code would be able to open the locks without authorization. Yeah, but now anyone who solves the puzzles can get through. In other words, pretty much anybody. I've never seen Dr. Sechenov wearing a bracelet before. Does his Alpha Connector look different? Indeed it does. His device is unique, and it shapes the location on one of Dr. Sechenov's deepest secrets. So his Alpha Connector must be really well guarded. Who's watching, the gentleman? Entrusting humans with the Connector would be far too risky. It's guarded by Dr. Sechenov's personal bodyguards. You mean the ballerina twins? The way they move, they're so graceful and elegant. They kind of remind me of something. Is that so? What exactly, Comrade Major? I don't know. Something... something good.
have reached the facility's service rooms, Major. One of my dear Claire's legs is most certainly there. Yeah, the truth is out there, right? I've never seen bots like these before. This robot is very dangerous in melee combat. Uh, oh, so that's why I get my ass kicked. Charles, why did the boss take the real beta connectors out of commission? Were they defective? Not entirely. Dr. Sechenov wasn't convinced that there was any need for discretionary authority within Collective. So the boss wanted total equality, but Molotov's schemes changed his mind? Perhaps so, Comrade Major. What do you mean, perhaps? Dr. Sechenov wanted equality for everyone. There can be no question of that. But consider this. The Alpha Connector existed from the very beginning. Maybe the boss wasn't planning to use the Alpha Connector's power. He just needed it to launch Collective. That's possible, right? Anything is possible. Already. We're running out of time here. Here's your leg, do yourself a pair thing. <laughs> cool tech. Scanning cycle. Module, limb, arm, right, found. Location, Vavilov floor. Transmission obstructed. Data incomplete. <sighs> What's the holdup? Why can't we locate the module this time? I'm afraid I can't help you. There's some kind of interference on this floor. Possible sources of interference include electromagnetic shielding or the presence of a large, elongated object. A large, elongated object? That sounds odd. Wow, there's a big honking thing in here, and lots of little fuckers.
What am I supposed to do with this? What is this, a kid's game? That is a puzzle key. Nice. What's it for? I believe it activates some sort of process. Charles, is that the process I just activated? Run! Where? Hey, hey, what the hell are you doing, damn it? You metal son of a bitch. You scared the ever living fuck out of me. That was close. Well, whatever. I got the arm. This looks like the right one. Let's go find the rest.
Charles, so after the whole beta connector idea was dead, they made the neuro connectors with discretionary authority? I'm afraid so. The power struggle in the Kremlin will never end. Party elite insisted on having power even within collective. Well, they're our government, right? We're the USSR. Indeed, we are. Where's your but fucking collective button? was designed to be for everyone on Earth, and the USSR is not the only country. We can't let capitalists and imperialists into collective. Why not? Collective was designed as a worldwide union for equal human beings. The robots will do everything for them. Everyone will have the same opportunities. The capitalists won't like the sound of that. Unfortunately, no one in power will see equality as an appealing prospect. So to avoid being crushed by the Kremlin, Dr. Sechenov programmed his legendary authority into collective. I see. Arms good. Scanning cycle. Module. Limb. Arm. Left. Found. Location Pavlov floor. Uh, could you be a little more specific? No! This is terrible. It plunged into something warm and sticky. Oh my. It is red polymer. Disgusting. What does this even mean? I am sorry, dear comrade. This is the only data I have available. I hope I managed to help you. You sure did. <clears throat> Wow, a lock. Didn't see that coming.
What's that crap in the canisters? Be careful. That is a specimen called plush, or ivy. It is extremely dangerous. Yeah, I've seen this crap before. And of course, the ripped off arm is in there too. Why could it just be lying in a corner somewhere? Son of a bitch almost took me out. Let's hope another one of those freaks doesn't come crawling out of the next canister. According to my data, the second canister is sealed properly. Have you infiltrated the VDNH yet, Major? The government commission is almost here. I'm inside, looking for a way to activate military drill mode. Things have been complicated by a shitload of... Whoa! Hey! Why isn't anybody working?
So what was wrong with the real Beta Connectors? Since Collective was originally planned without any discretionary authority, everyone in it was supposed to be equal. Yeah, we already talked about that. Then why'd they need the Beta Connectors? To secure Collective against unforeseen threats from individuals who might wish to control it. That's impossible. Everybody's equal in Collective. Shit. The Alpha Connector. Indeed. Intruders or an opposition force among equals could try to obtain the Alpha Connector. This could lead to human casualties, which would be unacceptable. So how could Beta Connectors stop this from happening? They didn't give their carriers any discretionary authority, but they did allow them to be present within Collective without being a part of it. In other words, they had total autonomy while retaining access to the information network. So what? That's basically what we have right now. You're seeing this from a human perspective. What other kind of perspective could I... Oh, crap. The boss wanted to put beta rings on some robots so no one else in Collective could control them. Indeed they are. At first, Dr. Sechenov planned to order his loyal twins to guard the Alpha Connector. While logged into Collective, he could control them from anywhere on Earth. At the same time, no one else would be able to give them orders. They wouldn't even know that they exist. Hold on, Charles. <laughs> I don't quite get it. Would it be possible to launch Collective with everybody equal? Then, destroy the Alpha Connector? Certainly, but that begs another question. Who would choose to do that? Dr. Sechenov. Are you sure about that, Comrade Major? Yeah, I mean, I guess.